I uh, woke up this morning and saw just a bunch of people complaining about Taylor Swift. And uh, mainly because now Taylor Swift's boyfriend, Travis Kelsey, who by, you know, himself, he's a great athlete. Great. Uh, so, but the Chiefs are going to the Super Bowl. People are freaking out now because the game is corrupted because a, a person is attending the games. Uh, I just think it's a bunch of insecure men who they just wish that they were part of the uh, living the glory days themselves and could go back and, you know, be cool. I don't know. It's about as dumb as complaining that anybody else, like any other athlete, their mom is here, so they're, they're distracted. Somebody they care about is in the stands, so they're distracted. Nobody complains when a family member of an Olympian is like super into the swimming race. No one complains about that. Uh, but here we are complaining about Taylor Swift and her boyfriend, Travis Kelsey. Just enjoying life. Stop it. Furthermore, I saw other people complaining that Taylor Swift might endorse a presidential candidate and that somehow that would corrupt uh, American politics forever. And uh, I don't know, it's because she's a celebrity? But I just want people to remember that a celebrity already like swayed politics multiple times. Ronald Reagan was an actor. Donald Trump was famous for, for being rich and then famous for being on The Apprentice. They were celebrities and so Celebrities are allowed to make their opinion known, and we need to just stop it. Just stop it. Let people like what they like. Let people enjoy the game or not enjoy the game. All these NFL people who are like the broadcast for the NFL when Taylor's in the game, in the game, at the game. You know what they're doing? They're enlarging their audience because they're not idiots. And so why are we complaining that capitalism is working? Why are we complaining that people who uh, know that Taylor Swift is a draw for a whole new segment to watch the football games? You know, the NFL was on its last legs because of injuries and people were concerned that people were, it's too violent. But now all these people are, are watching NFL games, maybe because Taylor Swift might be there, but they're also, watching the game, giving the game new life. Why are we mad about that? Why are we upset? It's because we're small, insecure men and we're gatekeeping. Uh, as, a, as a nerd, as a comic book reader, I'm a fan of nerd culture. When the Marvel Cinematic Universe started to really flourish, I, who have been, I've been a part of this universe and reading these comics and loving these characters for so long, I could have said all these people are just coming because Chris Pratt is a really handsome person or because Scarlett Johansson is a beautiful woman or whatever. I could have made all those complaints, but I didn't because I recognized that more people are going to love these characters that I love. That's awesome. So let's all just stop complaining about people being interested in things. Let's stop complaining about celebrities using their influence to make a, a, a move, a shift in uh, the political climate because that's been happening for over 200 years in America. People of influence have been using their influence. So let's just calm down, start over, and uh, like, you know what, if we really care, get out, vote, be, a poli be, be involved. And if you disagree with Taylor Swift's politics, you're free to do that. Try to help it can make an argument other than you can't just be a celebrity and endorse things. That's weak and dumb and uh, it's so sad, so sad. So yeah, I just, it, it was on my mind as I was driving into work and I was like, I should just, I should just say something about it. So I'm saying something about it.